All right, we loading in. So I'm gonna um, we're gonna become a bounty hunter. We uh, we should have the money, the gold bars to do the profession. So it's supposed to be a really good way to earn some money and also gold bars or whatever. So we're gonna check it out. Old Charles needs to get his hat back on. Uh. Where's Susan at? I do. Uh, I also I want to finish the um, the dang story mode if we can. We are down here, and I'd like to. All right, let's see. Let's see if we can match make into this while. Uh, while we sort of wait on folks to get in the chat if people tune in um and we'll you know we'll do this in the meantime see if we can get the, the matchmaking to work i thought toast might be gonna play tonight we can see players not currently in your session I think he's offline. Yeah, because I can't invite him. I have an empty ability card slot. Hold on. Hold the phone. Uh, ability loadout. Second passive. We got horsemen. Dual wielding. Blah, blah, blah. Sharpshooter while using a scope. Go a little more damage, take a little less damage. Fifteen seconds ain't no freaking way, dude. Uh I feel like this is it. As you get closer to death, you start to do a little more damage. We got, I feel like we gotta do that. We I don't I, why is that the first uh that's the first passive and uh, we can't even dual wield yet. All right, let's buy that. At some point, we will upgrade these um, these cards. You know what I'm saying? We did that, yeah. Okay. But uh, that ain't it. Ain't the point yet to where we want to spend money on that. out here we got susan she's max bonded now i played a little bit off stream uh last night and today i'm just having fun getting on and messing around you know Yo, what up, man? Just out here living the cowboy life, you know? <clears throat> We're trying to hit level 25 so we can dual wield pistols. Uh, that's the thing we need to do. And, uh, 
we're going to do some bounty hunting here in a little bit. Hopefully we can match make. Almost crushed. How'd she do that? Hopefully we can get this matchmaking to work. I'm glad she said almost, so it didn't get crushed, I'm assuming. Come on now. We're only going to give this a few tries. I don't super want to uh, sit here all night waiting on this. reckon they got all the wood for to build these houses out here they had to bring it in via a wagon or on the railroad I reckon there ain't no trees out here not for real might be a scraggly one here and there that ain't a log cabin made from cacti I don't guess Oh, yeah, dude. I'm glad. Dude, that would have really hurt. You could have lost that finger, man. Could have just got whacked plumb off. You got stuck up in the door. Come on now. I feel like we've been in matchmaking for a while now. I don't know how long it'll it'll sit in matchmaking for it times out. That'd be like a minute and a half or something. Two minutes maybe. Look at this horse. That's like a thing floating in the air, man. Yeah, she would have felt horrible if she slammed her little finger up in the door. Heck yeah, here we go. Let's get it, dude. We got match made. Uh, after this mission, I think we need to see about getting some upgrades on our rifle, our repeater, because I know I hadn't upgraded that all the way. 
and maybe get the other two on the pistol. I think I was lacking like two on the uh, my revolver. See, see what if we can't just max out and get all the upgrades we want. Maybe do a little decorative engraving or something. All right. Do we got to have four for this one? Oh, hanging at Tom Davies, I tell you. Charles ain't got his shoes on. That was portly gentleman. Looks like he's sporting a tuxedo. You know? He's got the tuxedo jacket on. Is that a exclusive? That's a crazy looking outfit. That one dude, the dude on the left looked pretty dang generic and the guy on the right looks pretty crazy. It's always interesting to see how people do their character creation. Cause I know how day I'll spend a lot of time. Old Charles was a laborer of love, I tell you. Your friend, the marshal, hang him for being your friend and doing good in a bad world. Montez's boys going to teach goodness a lesson. Teach law a lesson. Tell order it don't exist no more in this chaos of a world. They got him in tumbleweed, and they're going to lynch him. Or they're going to mm -mm. lure you in there and lynch all you. Guess you'll have to figure that out. <laughs> We gotta stop old Tom Davies from getting lynched, I reckon. And that ain't no good. Come on, let's go. Why does it give me Kevin? I don't want Kevin. It's tumbleweed. I said that. Marshal Davies crossed the line when he killed Alfredo there. Killed him without That's that's so trash, dude. Dang, now I gotta wait on my stupid horse. Story mission. Susan. Race. Come on. Competitive. Susan. Free roam. Susan. Okay, race. We can do... We can do. We should do Kevin for the races, but we can't. Horse must be saddled before you use it. What? Is Kevin any saddled? Listen here. These two men are killers. The worst kind of killers. The kind that hide behind. Hopefully, they teleported me here, huh? So today, Marshal Davies and Sheriff Freeman are going to get what's coming. Do it. If I could do it, I'd kill him again. Do it! Tom! Dang, Tom, man. Come on now. Can we shoot the rope or something?
If that's Kevin, I swear to goodness. All that is holy. Yeah, Susan, yay. Y'all got him? And all these fellas is prime for looting, you know? What's the worst part then, man? All right, let's go. So your sister's okay though? I'm oh, sorry, I'm I'm trying to I'm trying to glance over and still help out the team here. A little car wreck. Like airbags and uh Oh come on. Thank you. Okay, nice, nice, nice. It's so he's more aerodynamic when he fights, you know? His science behind it. He's got more uh, range of motion, you know, his armpits ain't constrained. Uh, so like when he when he aims and all, he, like he's just better aiming. Where did, uh, dang, the marshal and them done rode off a ways, huh? I hope the other homie is, uh... Oh, shoot. I'm gonna save me. Save old Charles! <laughs> Favorite soda type? Uh, I do like a, like a Dr. Pepper. Like a Diet Dr. Pepper. Original Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew's good. I like a Pepsi. 
boy, my team uh, is kind of... Mm, okay. Do we do it? I take back what I said. I try not to drink a whole lot of soda sodas, man. I drink like a Diet Dr. Pepper or something. What's up, Liz? Thank you. I mean, it's a lot of sugar in them things, you know? Yes, thank you. I ain't trying to get the diabetes. I don't like requiring help, but this time I did. Marshall Davies. I got, uh... Thank you. Y'all heard of them yeah, ghost energy drinks? We leave I like them. I got me one of them. It's a uh, Swedish fish flavored. Boy, it's fine. Never. I just like watching what other folks is, that's all. There's a word for fellows like you. Wise? Is that the word? Come, Marshall. Help me get home. It's been quite enough excitement for a clapped out old fool. Well past his best for one day. Friends, I'll see you again, I hope. But next time, under better circumstances, I trust. Well, I, I want to know what jacket it is that fella's got on. That's a pretty wild looking jacket. We gotta, uh, I wonder how far I am in the story. Cause I think we gotta finish the story before we can do any moonshining. His moonshine is locked unless it's level locked. When I look at it, it says it's locked. I like the, uh, the moonshiners, uh, the story was, was fun as far as I remember. Like there's little missions to get you started, uh, making shine, you know? Well, we're going to do some bounty hunting uh, here in a little bit. I, I would like to see if I can finish this story. Old Charles <laughs> in the overalls. I switched up my Sunday meeting outfit a little bit. I'll show you here in a sec. What was this? There's something here, uh, Desert Sage. Let's pick and get all the sage that we can, you know. We're gonna cook that with some venison, I reckon. What's this? Got some berries or something? All right, uh, Susan. I think it's three. Yeah, look at look at old Charles Sunday meeting outfit. Looking mighty fine right there, I tell you. This is a, I'm not even, I'm not even going to pretend that I don't really like this outfit. Yeah, dude, I wanted him to look like, I mean, I don't know. That look, it looks pretty nice. It looks respectable. Like it, he looks real fancy. I want like a cheaper looking fancy. You know what I'm saying? I like it though. I like this outfit a lot. All right, we're going to the gunsmith. We, uh, how much money did we get from that? A little bit, a little bit. We got a little bit of gold, too. Susan Dirty. What? Why can't I feed Susan? Oh, eat, eat that carrot, Susan. Uh, we should probably see about getting a bolt action rifle at some point too. Uh, I know that's gonna be good for hunting. It says she's still dirty? What? 
Come on now. It's dusty out here in the desert, I reckon. We could start uh, the bounty hunter thing out here. I need to uh, change my uh, my outfit and get into some more appropriate attire. Okay, so that's just aesthetic barrel. I think we already got the we got the long barrel. We need improved rifling and get a little bit more range out of it. Okay, uh, and then we're gonna we got the improved sights. Okay, so we got our pistol good and maxed out. Mavis, it's a general store. Tell her Roscoe says hello. Okay. Uh, all right, we need to check our Lancaster. All right, man. All in that well, are you? Weapon looks good. Variants? Collector's variant? That's interesting. Oh, well, that's cool. That's expensive. Opponents, uh, get some improved rifling. And we got the improved sights. Oop. We don't want a scope necessarily. You want me to install some nicer sights? I can do it. That's aesthetic. Uh, someone was saying that I remember back in the day there was like a debate that the the uh, the wrap would make it yeah get get dirty slower you know styles uh wrap leather we got to get yeah we got to go chocolate on the uh on the wrap and then we got to see if we can get some barrel. We don't want gold. I like the blued steel, but that's like a whole gold bar, dude. You can take a good old look at anything I have. We're just going to keep that. Ain't loaded, Engravings. That's all expensive. Oh, we can't see the carvings. Uh, there's a varnish. Okay, with a. Is there like a mahogany? Yeah, yeah. I feel like that's a waste of money, though. I wanted to do an engraving, too. the sheriff in this town he's a snake I think I like the baroque the best even though it's the cheapest sometimes cheap is good you know oh 
All right, they were gonna put a little dang on a little dot on the end of it, huh? They should just oh, that's neat. Left in armadillo, if you ask me. Clean All right, uh, we got it. Um, you've been cleaning that good, I can tell. We got everything. We got everything upgraded. I think we're going to go ebony on that pistol whenever we get there. And we'd probably do blued steel. Maybe with some gold. Right now we're alright there. We're alright there. Alright. We broke again, y'all. <laughs> That's like story of Red Dead Online right now. Alright, uh let's go fast travel. Cause I think I want to go bounty hunt. Can we fast travel to Thieves Landing? go to Blackwater and then we'll ride over there to we can do another we do another, I'm trying to do that other story mission I want to I want to get it done with them you know because they're kind of a kind of a pain sometimes because like the matchmaking isn't always fantastic Let's see. We need to see about getting a new vest for old Charles too. At some point. Howdy, Colton Harrington Heming son, the Rodeo Bandit. I'll call you Rodeo Bandit. How's it going, man? There's old Charles out here doing uh, doing some cowboy things. I'm trying to finish up the story missions, ideally. Uh, But sometimes it's matchmaking because I mean obviously player count isn't what it used to be uh, sometimes it's matchmaking don't be matching you know so we'll give it give it a couple tries at least we match made second try on that last mission so that ain't bad I wish you just let me like do something while I match made. 
but I just got to sit here and look at this uh, cinematic sort of screen, you know, like a like a live wallpaper or something. I think I'd be fine by myself, you know, uh, if they just let me do it. it. Might take longer, be harder, but that's okay. You guys, is there a watermelon on that table next to her? What you reckon? I think it is. Well, I almost got some watermelon at the store tonight. I do love me some watermelon. Someone got to be, yeah, yeah, I was about to say, someone got to be either doing that or doing the story mission on call, coming to my rescue. We just uh, saved Sheriff Davies from getting hung. Now we about to see what we're up to this time. We need money. Need lots of money. Like the horse I want, I think is a thousand. That's a lot. And then of course we're gonna need saddles. We need a bunch of random stuff. But at least we got uh we got the guns upgraded. Uh, I think all the way that that we want them. The, the two main guns we use: the repeater and the uh, the six shooter. I'm so glad you came. She does have a strong jawline, you know. Not been entirely in vain. <laughs> have produced some rather surprising results. Well, not surprising, but confusing. Confusing. After castigating me as a a widow, a harlot, a fool. What's castigating me? Anything and everything. Suddenly, shortly after we killed his brother-in-law, Amos Lansing wants to talk. He sent word via an intermediary. Mr. Jones. <laughs> Even that crazy old fool said not to trust any of it. Which is why we need you. You're to help keep Mrs. Leclerc protected during the meeting at Blackwater. I shouldn't imagine they would kill us in broad daylight, but you never know. I never imagined they'd kill my husband, nor turn me into a fugitive. Anyway, friends, shall we go? Uh-huh. Let's do it. Today may go any number of ways. Let me drive that thing. So once the shooting starts... All of them end up dead. One of you drive the wagon. The other, keep guard. Thank you. I got it, man. I'm on Tokyo Drift, that thing. Tell you. Old Charles. Get old Charles on the range. Something. I don't know exactly what yet, but... I don't think any of us think Mr. Lansing has become a saint, madam, but uh, perhaps we should hear him out. Perhaps. Ooh, come on, let me try that thing. Would you kindly take us to Blackwater? Yeah. Are you getting in the back? I do confess. Can't she get in the back? Strange appointment. Like I said, I would be much more comfortable going as your emissary, ma'am. And I said I wanted to hear what he had to say. So look him in the eye. Professional like Tokyo Drift up in here, I'm telling you. Stay by my side, or 
or you can look over the meeting from some vantage point. Remember, this is not just the man who killed my husband. He, his wife, and Jeremiah Shaw all had a hand in putting you away and setting you up for the gallows. So these are the folks that uh, framed us. So we about to get our revenge here. She's shooting at. She's practicing. Old Charles is on the job. I tell you, you stay right here. Take this. I'll be back. No, I can't wait to get my dual pistols, man. Hey, hello, darling. Hello, darling. Hey, Mr. Lansing. You too. Jessica, how lovely to see you. Why, it's been a, a long, long time. No, it hasn't. Not compared with all eternity. Oh, Jessica, I miss Philip every. Oh, Charles <laughs> looks like a ruffian back there. Quite terrible, but you seem. <laughs> My dear, you seem under the misapprehension that I had something to do with his demise. You, your wife, or your business partner, at least one of you did, and your brother-in-law. But he's dead. Well, he was a bad man. I'm glad he was killed. Sure. It cleans up your mess, doesn't it? You don't seem quite well, my dear. Mm -hmm. I am destroyed with grief. Oh, of course. Yeah, life can be terrible. But, well, there is a business matter that we I hate his beard. I hate those beards. It, you know. Well, you see, why grow the mustache too, dog? Dying, the other took you look Amish, you know? For Such a weird fashion choice. Uh, you lie, sir. You signed. Last year, the document lies with Mr. Shaw there. He also has your money. $500. $500? Is worth a hundred times that, you thief. You murderous Madam thief! Madam Let Clerk, I will ask you to watch your manners. Uh, I have good standing in this town. Oh, you do, do you? I am a man of impeccable morality. Mm-hmm. Well, impeccable morality. Little to fear of death. You god awful swine. Heck yeah. Get a Michel Clerk.
Now, he said one of them fellas had $500. That was 91 cents. These dudes broke, man. Look at her purse right there. It's a magical purse. Floating in the air right there. Hear that? Follow Horley or protect. Let's protect Miss Leclerc. All right, we're killing it. Well, he had 86 cents. Every little bit helps, you know. I think it had a whole dollar. Can kill him. Dead Eyes level eight. Oh. Where's Susan at? All right, Horley, come on. Harley got left. <laughs> Ouch. Susan, come on now, girl. Come on.
Is Horley just back there doing his own thing now? He's running? That's so funny. It's so funny. I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to happen. Susan got to get her, uh, her wide posterior on over there. Eating all them apples, man, you know. I think there's uh there's just like random stage coaches riding around that are good to rob too, I think. I'll take it from here. Here are the documents, madam. They were he teleported, he ran real forged. fast. Here. I don't need to see them. No, I don't suppose you do. Although there's uh There's Grace Lansing, but she will have to wait. And also we have to decide how we're gonna clear all our names and Extricate ourselves from the mess we have uncovered. Extricate. State authorities take too kindly to revenge killings, madam. <laughs> no, I'm sure they don't. But that's a problem for another day. Because right now, that little plot is over. And my husband has been avenged. My friends, my true friends. I owe you more than words can say. Uh huh. Thank you. And should our paths cross again, and well, I'm sure they may. But right now, I need to make myself scarce. And I recommend that you all do your best not to get into too much additional trouble. That's your business. <laughs> Poor husband. I kind of like her, dude. He deserves so much better than this, but this is what he got. She really loved her husband. This is what we all got. Drive on, Mr. Holy. Mm-hmm. Okay. 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 I can't remember how the dual pistol thing works i think i gotta buy another pistol right that, that makes sense it wouldn't make sense to just you get the dual pistol holster and then automatically have dual pistols right All right, hit rank 21. We got the stalker hat unlocked now. That was a pretty decent chunk into 21 as well. That's good, good. 25 is when we get the dual pistols. What? That was a lot of money right there. <laughs> yeah, I did, Blake. One of my shorts was kind of popping off today. So that's always fun. It's always interesting to see. All right. Uh, let's see. What's up, man? Uh, let's see if there's another mission. We don't see no missions. 
Where are we at? We're at a uh, Manzanita post. We can go. Let's go. Let's go do some bounty hunting down here around Blackwater, I reckon. Either that or we go to Valentine. Valentine's always like crazy, dude. Let's go back to Blackwater. We should be able to pick up the license uh, just from any bounty board, I believe. Where is that it? Bye, Blake. <laughs> Hello and goodbye. All right, man. Have a good night. Is my camp over here? What is that? A race? But do you leave? I mean, I ain't gonna make you. I mean, I can't make you stay, dude. You leave if you want to. Stay if you want, hang out for a while. We're just piddling around, man. Doing Red Dead stuff. I need to see... Let's go look while I'm thinking about it. We're gonna go... Rancher. I need to see what... Um, there's this one saddle. Pack and services, saddles. It's a. No, uh, it is the. This one. Level 35. $512. Dang, man. Stuff's expensive, dude. Which one do we have? We got uh, a Lumley Ranch Cutter Saddle. We got a High Plains Cutting Saddle. Boy, that thing's nice looking, isn't it? I did not mean to buy that. Well, dang. Now I can sell this one, though. Jimmy, he's trying to invade. Which uh, dang saddle? A high plains cutting saddle. This is the one we want. It's what thirty-five. Yeah.
Is it because we already bought it? That's all, uh... That looks similar to what we have. That's 27. That's a better saddle. We'll probably chill. Um, not buy another saddle until we get the. That's weird, 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 weird. Um. I can't find the, the saddle that we own. Okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. Upgrade, Kevin? How do you upgrade? Oh, 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 oh. Uh huh. Okay. All right, I need to get out of here. Well, that menus be confusing sometimes, dude. Wait, do I have good saddlebags? Did I buy those? Okay. Jimmy, all right, Jimmy. Good old Jimothy. All right, now we're gonna see about becoming a bounty hunter. We are gonna be the law, I tell ya. Uh huh. Purchase. What is prestigious? What what does that mean? Let's uh what is license and prestigious? It adds what ten ranks of progression totaling thirty, so it adds more ranks of progression to the. Welcome back, Blake. Infamous bounty hunter mission. As a result, players should buy the prestigious bounty hunter mission the first chance they get. Well, how do I... Uh... Huh. So, if I buy the regular one, then I can buy the prestigious one later? Maybe?
Yes. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So I can buy that later. Alright. Legendary bounties? How much? We're going to see about this. Jimmy, my boy, is evil. Well, don't let evil people take over you. I'll be right back. Mr. Philip Carlier. I don't know where to start with this one. I remember when his poster first went up. Mild-mannered, they said. Well, they all are, until they ain't. I might have even looked for him, too, but none of us could find him. We gonna find him. It sounds like they spotted him in the swamps. If that's where he's been... He's hiding down there in the swamps. Then God help him. Good thing we, I mean, we from the south. The swamps ain't nothing to us. This dude look crazy. Got to ask what years of that might have done to his mind. He's crazy from living out there in the swamps. Yes, sir, Blake. No one would ever come. Philip Carlier, the Castile Cotton Company chief clerk. But uh, <laughs> so you already know that, given why you're here. Oh, I can't imagine how it must look. Crazy. Oh, yeah. no, no time Scared. That. Now, if you just let me. Oh, I'm so hoping for Is this crazy, to dude? <laughs> He done dosed us. Some sort of crazy swamp plants he done threw up in that kettle. Uh huh. Now look at this. Hang on, man. We out here tripping. Tripping. That's a giant owl. That's a giant chicken over there. I got two lives. See that giant bunny rabbit? Look at that. That's crazy, isn't it? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh. You done killed me? Am I supposed to be making it somewhere? Maybe that house? I think to the house. Follow the owl. That may not be a bad idea. I think we're get, I think we're getting we're doing something, you know. We're making some sort of progress.
All right. So you just head to the house on that one, huh? So we gotta, he's, he's somewhere over here. We gotta try and uh, take him alive if we can. What's 16 times four? I have no idea. 32 and 32 is 64. You're glitching? Dude, all his homies have machetes, too. Dang, did they, hopefully they didn't, uh, hopefully they didn't get him. Free him, did they free him? I'm out of lives, bro. This is bad. So you can get over here. Oh my gosh, dude. Come on. All right, Blake, I'll catch you later, dude. This is, I mean, hmm. it'd be easier with, it'd be easier with a posse. That's fine. But, uh, I feel like we can do this still. We gotta be able to do this. Pro Jamer. Oh, what's up? Welcome back, Glitch. Take my time this time. We basically we got a hog time, right?
Oh, come on, bruh. Ten thirty-five for me, dude. He's cheating with these dang alligators, man. Susan. Where'd you run out of the swamp? Okay, okay, okay. He's about to be up by a road. That's gonna be good for me. All right. The future is a. Uh Susan did not go on a diet. The future is, you know, pretty much like the past, I reckon. We're working on, we want, we want a different horse. You know what I'm saying? We always want something uh, bigger and better. The, the future's just like an hour ahead, you know? Two hours ahead. Shut up. You can punch him. We're going to see how much this pays. We're at 239 right now, seven gold. I'm not going to abandon Susan. We're going to keep Susan. We're going to get rid of Kevin, though. <laughs> I think I might uh, get... I might get one of the bounty hunter horses, or we might do a Missouri Foxtrotter. The Foxtrotters are always... They were really fast. The future is like the past. But just in the ahead time. Told you to shut up. When? No, he broke free. Come on now, Philip. No, you're fine, Blake. Toss him in the sternest cell you can find. There's your bounty. You show sure wound it. Heck yeah, I did. That was a legendary bounty. Oh 
my goodness. You're getting deep over there, Glitched. Time stops for no man, you know? The future is inevitable and will become the past, you know? I just ran into myself. There's two of me's. Why is that? Why is that a thing still? Like, it can't be the, uh, how much money was that? Oh, dang, a ton of XP. Why is that still a bug, you know? That was like a hundred gold, right? All right, let's go check the bounty board. Oh, I can do one legendary bounty per hour, I guess. I'm a dead or alive. Now you can replay legendary bounty ambitions at the bounty board. Later, Blake. We're going to try this one. Alejandro and Concha Gillian. Okay. Go to the camp. We're trying to get rich, man. 300, 335. I wonder how much these regular bounties, like these regular degular ones are, are worth. I'm not gonna. Uh, I mean, yeah, yeah. I'm, Kevin's gonna go. To, Kevin's gonna go to the glue farm. <laughs> he's the, he is the OG. Uh, we might keep him for a minute. I don't know. I don't know. He's the free thoroughbred horse that we got with the whatever deluxe edition game. So it's not that big of a deal. Giving up, Kevin. Eventually, we're going to need all the uh, stable space, you know? I don't know if we'll end up with 10 horses up in there. How far are we going? Where is it? Okay, we're almost there. target
We're going to try and catch this lady fella, whoever. The, I think this is the lady, right? We got her. So I think, yeah, 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 we can, I think we can make multiple trips. Pick her up. Oh my goodness, bro. For real. He's spry, man. What am I gonna name my next horse? I was like, uh, like maybe a Jebediah or something. Harold. Larry. Uh, something like that. Miguel. Shut up. Quit your yapping, lady. He's quick. Old Charles is quick like the wind, I tell you. Young Charles. <laughs> That would be good, man. If there's ever a game where I can't make an old, old character, I might make a young Charles. Three thirty six. What we got? Seems someone's time is all but spent. Sales open. So we were at three thirty six. We'll see what uh what they give us. That wasn't terrible. I think one got away. Six twenty five. I mean, I didn't do great on that. I think you get more money. Dead or alive. Been spotted looting the deceased persons in Armadillo. He's not a fugitive. Six dollars? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's more about the experience sometimes, you know? I think there's this thing where... Uh, he, yeah, I feel like that was worth more than six dollars. I mean, six dollars back then, that's, uh, you know... That's good money. Uh... I think there's a thing there used to be where you'd wait for the timer to be like in the last minute or so three minutes maybe something like that and uh you'd turn it in and you get more yeah yeah but i hate that man i hate just sitting there running the timer down or it's like i don't know dude i just feel like it's kind of a cheesy like the, I, the, it feels broken to me it feels like a broken mechanic there's no other way to look at it. Because you should get paid more the quicker you get it done. I feel like.
scouting spot. Is this a good scouting spot? What does it mean, scouting spot? Come on, Susan. We can't let him get away. Yeah. Dang, where did he go? Okay. I got like a little red blip on my mini map or something. Okay, I see. I see where he's at. Uh, Toast played a little bit uh, last night and a little bit today, as far as I know, but I don't think he was streaming any of it. He got a little bit frustrated about the state of the auto aim. Because he's just wanting to play mouse and keyboard, not controller. But to me, I love this game on controller. I feel like it's just perfectly done for a controller. Uh, but he wants to use his mouse and keyboard. And he got a little bit frustrated about it last night. Because we were doing some like infighting with the posse or whatever. And uh, it's just, it's not, it, it almost seems not fair that mouse and keyboard players are in the same lobbies as controllers with the auto aim, you know? And then you search the internet for information on it, and like what's better, mouse keyboard versus the controller with the auto aim. And there's like two divided camps. Some people are like, mouse and keyboard is always going to be better for shooter type games because you've got more control over where you aim and you can just headshot so much easier. And then people are like, well, the auto aim is really overpowered. I mean, it does lock straight to your, uh, your enemy. And then all you got to do is aim up a little bit and you get a headshot kind of thing. But, I don't know. I like it. I just think it's fun, man. I like the controller. I like being... I like the auto-aim. And, you know. I think that that's why they made... That's why they made the game the way they made it, you know? So you can auto-aim and feel like a cowboy riding around on your horse and stuff. When Toe's going to be able to play again, uh... He's probably, uh, it'll probably be the weekend, and and that kind of depends on what his kids are doing. Aim assist is greater than dead eye. Oh yeah, for sure, dude. Aim assist is is like goaded, bro. And I turned it, I turned it, I turn it up, man. I turned it on wide, and I turn it on as strong as it goes, dude. Like yeah. <laughs> We trying to snap the targets, bro. He's a bad man. Y'all don't worry about this. We gotta loot him first. You had eight cents. You broke. We're gonna get the, uh, we'll get the reinforced lasso here at some point. So now, correct me if I'm wrong, I need to wait for it to be, what, within a minute? Three minutes? What's the time, what's the time frame, you know what I'm saying?
I'm gonna see if I can Google it. Oh, nice. If you're gonna search it up, that's awesome, bro. I appreciate you. Oh, excuse me, sir. I'm gonna hitch up Susan right here. What is horse? Oh, a horse car going I'm, uh, I'll do a little bit of Googling too. How long to wait for bounties? How long should I wait before turning into bounty? It says wait until 30 seconds left. Oh gosh, dude. Well, y'all enjoying the weather? I was playing with a friend the other day and he waited until the last 30 seconds so we just ran around strawberry for six minutes we could have just done another three six nine and twelve minutes never wait at all So it's saying, if you're doing bounties for gold, six, nine, 12 minutes work fine. But for cash and XP, nine minutes works best. Waiting in the last 30 seconds is a waste of time. So if someone said waiting in the last 30 seconds is a waste of time. They better pay me almost $10. Yeah, this shit. All right, we're at 343. Let's go up in here. All right, so we're at 343.24, 22 bucks. That ain't bad. That ain't a bad little chunk of change. Someone said do the Edda Doyle bounty and wait 20 minutes before turning her in and you'll get 200 something dollars. Bro, I think, I don't know, man. I think we're just going, we're just going to play the game, man. Yeah, 22 is, 22 is legit. I wonder what happened with that other one, like. We just turned it in real quick or something? Why we got an exclamation point on this thing? This guy killed a reverend? We don't take kindly to that. Capture John Anderson, dead or alive. Gray Woolen Mill. Someone's saying, okay, so like, if you wait, once you've started the mission, you wait some time before you go do it. That's supposed to give you more or something? I don't know, dude. Oh, 
I don't know. Said Reverend something or other. You take our sweet time getting there, you know. Look at how majestic Susan is. Gray woolen meal. That's such a strange, strange uh, mechanic, dude. It's just kind of odd. And I don't understand if that's an intended mechanic or that was kind of an oversight and they just never fixed it. They're like, yeah, if you, uh, you know, you take longer, you wait till the very last second, you get more money. <laughs> she ain't as aerodynamic as she once was, yeah. That's right. She just got a bit of heft to her. I just don't understand the logic behind that. They just want you to spend time playing the game, you know? Is that the the thing? Like, I don't know. Whatever. What is this? There's something hostile up ahead. We are the law now. Bounty hunters extraordinaire, I tell you. Oh, what's going? On? What's all that going on? Hmm. Come on, Susan. Susan, you're gonna get me killed, Susan. I think he done ran off this way. Oh my goodness. Uh, he's gonna screw up my bounty if he ain't careful. Oh, that was the, that was the bounty. Oh, we gonna deliver this fella dead, I reckon. I thought that was that guy that was griefing me. I mean, not really griefing me, but... Did Susan, did he unalive Susan? I pay my taxes. You gotta pay your taxes, man. Boy, where did that guy come from? That, that, that player, dude. <laughs> That's so funny. It just randomly it just showed up while I'm doing my bounty. Nah. I, I Susan just was taking her sweet time getting over there, I reckon.
I'm really just gonna turn this one in cause uh, it ain't it ain't worth cause I done killed the guy on accident. This one's gonna be like three dollars. You ready? I think the XP is pretty good though too. That's part of what we need. We need XP. Uh-oh. I hear some, uh, some commotion up here. Dang, that sounded like a whole thunderstorm. going on here oh out back I gotta drop him off out back now I was like what is going on why <laughs> I was being dense I was like why is it telling me to go to the back of the jail Six seventy five. That ain't bad. I was thinking it was gonna be three dollars, dude. I mean, it ain't great. We done did all the bounties here. What about we can go to Rhodes or something? Let's see if Rhodes, Rhodes might have some, uh, something good. Might have some bounties. May or may not. I feel like it, that and, um, the Saint Denis ones might overlap a little bit, you know? Rinse and co slaughtering house. Okay, that's a little ways away. Stake out the area undetected and wait for the target to arrive. Is that that dude that that may or may not be that guy that was, uh, Yep, that's the guy. Let's circle back around. Oh. 
Uh huh. It's old Charles, I tell you. Welcome back. Welcome back. Now we gotta. Uh, this fellow was shooting at me, so I have been distracted. Shooting at me and Susan now. Boy, hell yeah. Old Charles here. Now this fella started it. I don't feel bad about this whatsoever. Old Charles now. Don't take kindly to people shooting. Shooting him dead while we're doing these bounty missions. We just out here trying to make the world a better place. Y'all got something to say about it? Yep. I can give you that pump action right there. A little double up buck for you. Uh-huh. Uh, he back down here, by, down by the creek bed. We gonna hunt him down. He, he, now he wanna try and he wanna try and hurt Susan, but you know, I done thought about this and we came prepared for that. We're gonna go on foot though. Now you down to make me run on foot, trying to take out my transportation. I'm gonna be like, dang on old, like a uh, like a Wendigo or something, like a, just a terror in these woods. That's right. Okay. I feel better. Y'all feel better? <laughs> I, I feel good. I feel good about that interaction. I think he might have logged out, changed lobbies. His little red dot went away. I don't think he parlayed with me. Well, that killed some time on the way to the slaughterhouse. So that's good, right? Because that means we should have a, a bigger reward. He just got scared. Of, that's right. He should be a fur to old Charles, man. He's, uh, you know, protecting the West. Making it a better place. Ain't that right, Susan? Uh, we need to get a bounty hunter outfit. Like, that's important. Because this doesn't feel very bounty hunter-y. You know? So we need to, we need to try... Uh, we need to get a bounty hunter outfit here in a minute. Even though I said I wasn't spending any more money, like... You know, sometimes, I mean, whatever, dude, whatever. I got Susan. She's all I need. And, uh, you know, we're trying to get levels and all that. Um, uh, we do need our dual pistols, man. We need that bad. Susan is Susan's look at look at how sweet and majestic. What a what a majestic creature this is. I'm about to have to go buy bullets.
I feel like he went this way, yeah? Yeah. He's on a horse. I don't think his homies are coming. Son of a bitch. Mm hmm. Get as mad as you want. Shouldn't be breaking the law. You gotta do better, you know? You're gonna get a second chance now. New lease on life, if you will. It's up to you to, you know, what you do with it. Is there a look behind button? Yeah. Okay, that helps. I'm a changed man now. Old Charles ain't breaking no laws. That's all, that's really toast to pop. Like, I'm just there with him, you know? I don't typically just be unaliving folks without good reason. I'm gonna wait one minute and then when it goes under three, I'm gonna go turn him in. Whoa, language, bro. That's right. He shouldn't have bumped. That's a good re That's a good reason, isn't it? He shouldn't have bumped into Susan. She's delicate. Hurts her feelings more than anything. Boy, that's some uh, questionable hand placement on that fella you got slung over your shoulder, Charles. Look at that. You're right there, he's got a handful of cheek right there. I might, uh, I'd probably grab him down by the knees, you know? So I didn't have just a, uh, just your old mitt full of hiney, you know? Uh, choose a different way to hold him, you know? Grab him by the belt or something, maybe? You know, I don't, I don't know. Yep, Charles, Charles is acting a little zesty the way he's holding this fella. Shit! I'm glad you got him alive. Retribution shall be visited. There's your bounty. You show sure wound it. How much we get? What we get? What we get? What we get? 300 0.24 2250 that's what i'm talking about that's good money it's decent i don't know man i feel like we hadn't really gone hard we should have done the hunting wagon thing you've done a job too recently come back later okay uh i like some of the emotes and stuff uh the gun spinning 
we get the gun spinning from the bounty hunter. Oh, we gotta go to the speaking of guns, uh, we gotta go to the gun store. Get some ammunition. <laughs> Dang it, Susan. She was too big to fit through the gate, so she just yeeted me off. I hear something, uh... There's someone, uh, someone causing a ruckus over here. Is it this fella? Okay. Feel like someone's out there up to no good in San Denis. Howdy. Time. time for a new gun, perhaps? Do you need any assistance? We need uh we need ammunition, please, sir. Should we get a bow and arrow, man? All these cool gun belts are all locked right now. Yeah, the dead boot, but it ain't. I mean, it ain't nothing, nothing cool. What is this horsemanship? Let's look at it. Uh. Huh. Look at that thing, man. That's ugly. Oh, we can get, uh, we're going to be able to get one of these. Ooh, what is that? Boy, that's a, wow, hold on. Can I turn? How do I turn? What's that? It's got a snake on it or something? Bounty Hunter Roll 21. Well, we can get that thing, man. Look, that's not all fancy looking. What, what kind of colors we got? Got some silver. It's got a dang old rattlesnake on it, boy. I feel like that's something. I feel like old Charles would wear that snake. That snake with the, uh... Hey, we need that, uh, this one. Right? now. Black and gold. Black and silver. I'm more of a silver fan myself, you know? Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Pretty cool. What, uh, what rank are we... What rank are we with the dang... Bounty Hunter. Got some bolas? What? What is that? Oh, that's collector. Uh huh. Boy, three hundred fifty dollars for a lasso, boy. They tripping, dude. They trying to make me go broke. nearby. Be sure you take a gun. Uh huh. I do want that gun belt. <laughs> I do kind of want that gun belt. Uh, what does this one look like? Regent, Regent, Regent. Kind of fancy, isn't it? The the whole game, man. This is just stuff I want. You won't find a better selection of firearms this side of. That's like four hundred dollars worth of stuff right there. If I got that holster and the other holster, you know. Look at this thing. Boy, that's fancy, though. Got a rattlesnake on it. Goodness gracious, that looks good. 
We might save up for that. That's uh that's gonna be a ways down the road. That's at level twenty one. We ain't even hit ten yet. I mean I mean that's that's pretty good looking too though. And go with that that this version right there. Rank ten. Yeah. I'm here to help if you need me. Oh, plenty more on offer. It's like the whole point of the game is to spend money. Have you ever thought about getting some enhancements for that gun? Would you consider some of our gun improvements? Looks like you've been taking good care of that gun. Boy, Sea of Thieves, though, like, everything you get is cosmetic, you know? There's nothing, there's no other point other than to, to look the way you want to look, you know what I'm saying? Where it's like this, like, there's actually some functionality going on. Seriously. I mean, of course, uh, where's the tailor at? Taylor? Right here. Yeah, but I got real bored with Sea of Thieves, like, real quick. And I don't, I don't have the patience to do what Toast does, where he like goes and sits and waits for somebody so he can steal the stuff or whatever. What's this fellow doing? This fellow, look, it looks like I should be able to interact with him, but I don't guess I can. Put some money in his hat or something. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Uh, I was gonna go to the, the tailor, but I don't. I don't think we're gonna do that because I don't need to spend mo more money. Oops, sorry. Huge me. And boys, talk about grindy, man. Sea of Thieves is the grindiest game that you're grinding for no gameplay advantage. Uh, you're grinding for like a, a new sail or a new little doodad to put up in your boat. Like, mm-mm. And you gotta rely on other people. Like, you gotta have a crew, you get a crew together. I don't like people that much. You know what I'm saying? Not saying I don't like people, but I, yeah. if I'm if I'm reliant on somebody else to help me facilitate, like to facilitate me having a good time, like no, dude, I gotta be able to do it by myself. I gotta be able to have fun by myself, or I don't want to play the game. And whenever I was solo slooping, it was straight up a bad time. It was a bad time. There ain't no like, oh, it was kind of fun. No, it sucked, dude. Solo sloop sucks. There's no good way to solo play. Oh, I can do a legendary bounty. Uh, what was it? Edda Doyle? Here's what they were saying. Yeah, the three-player ships. I hate that you can't see when you're driving the three-player ship. Like, that thing sucks to dry and drive. Terrible, terrible, terrible. I mean, it's a it's a solid game for what it is, but it's just not conducive to solo players. And all right, Etta Doyle used to be known as Madame La Pearl. She runs a gang of other fallen women 
sticking up trains and coaches mostly, but seems to have a particular fancy for robbing Leviticus Cornwall of late. So his men have set a honeypot to lure her in. Tipped her off about a big stash of money and ammunition at Cornwall's freight yard in San Denis. Asked if I can send some good bounty hunters their way. Just be careful. They play smart. Uh, looks like she only sent one. Okay, we gotta move fast here. Come on. Now the bait's already been set. Edda Doyle and her girls could be here any minute. And Mr. Cornwall, you don't want his name anywhere near this. For reasons I'm sure you can understand. Just wants it dealt with quick and quiet. You're gonna want to ensconce yourself in here. Now wait till they bust in, and then, when the moment's right, ambush Miss Doyle and escort her into custody. They want her alive. Yeah, I bought like. I bought a sloop and I had a brig. Now don't worry about her cronies. She's the one with or did I have a galleon? A sloop and a galleon? I mean, I made a bunch of money. I did a bunch of like sea forts and stuff like that. It just got to be where it was straight up not fun, dude. Alright, now it's time. Find a place to hide. And I thought all the curses looked stupid. Like, why do I want to be a glowing skeleton? I want to be a pirate. That's why I'm playing a pirate game. Like, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I hate, I don't, I don't know. I know I sound cynical and like sour about it, but just like, geez, dude, I don't, I don't know. I just, mm. you know, if it, if, if people, you know, if, if you, if people like what they like, you know, but. Because of your monitor? What kind of monitor you got? Identify the real edit oil. Oh, I remember this. Oh, your PC can't handle the monitor. That sucks, bro. PlayStation's getting it. Uh, Sea of Thieves, apparently. What am I? It's saying observe. What am I supposed to be? What am I? Uh. Looking over my shoulder no more. 
Where is Susan at? Come here, Susan. Boy, that was pretty smooth, man. I dang on old, uh, jumped up in there, man. Shut up, Edda. Let's see how much we get for this one. They said something about waiting on this, but dang, I don't want to wait, dude. I hate that. All right now. Each thinking about it. Here we go. Let's see how many ducats we got here. And look, it's Charles and Charles, I tell you. Two of them fellas. Twice the good lookingness, you know? Where's that campfire? There's a campfire right there, too. That was only 30 bucks? What? I feel like I got robbed. That sucked, dude. I did it too quick. What a shame, man. What a weird, weird thing. Um, how much progress did we make on this right here? Uh, what? Rank two. Look at that. Oh boy. That's a daggone old what? What oh. unique outfit for the novice bounty hunter. Four dollars retail. Do I get it for free? For purchase at Madame Nazar. 
Uh-huh. That's $125 for that belt buckle. Or for the... That was four gold for the thing. I kind of like that without the belt buckle. You know? $350 for a reinforced lasso seems a bit ridiculous. What rank are we not? We're 21. I wish I'd give you a little bit of money every time you ranked up. That'd be nice. All right, I'll be right back. Well, that legendary bounty did not seem... That seems so lackluster. Oh, well. Be right back. All right, I have an idea. Uh, I'm going to go do one of them blood money missions while I wait on my legendary bounties to come back. Because that takes an hour for them to come back. But I should have took way longer to turn in Susan Doyle or whatever. Edda Doyle, whatever it was. Supposed to take 20 minutes, I think. Seems ugh, mm, I'm gonna quit fussing about that. I mean, nobody just enjoy listening to someone fuss incessantly about the same thing over and over again. But I wish I had did it in like under 10 minutes, so I should have got more, you know, not less. Cause I think this uh this one mission paid pretty dang good. Got some new jobs lined up. Capital, Blood money. If you're lucky. Got wind of some work needs doing. Three of three, the scandalous or the saloons. I think these part these these multiple part ones pay pretty good. It ain't just low lives trying to get their hands on capital. Fancy folk too. Hell. Anyone looking to give the tax man the slip. And apparently that includes the owner of the Bastille Saloon in Sand and Lee. I suggest you pay him a visit. Relieve him of his burden. I figured out what Capitale is. Words going around about you being on the hunt. So grow some eyes in the back of your head. So Capitale is like underground criminal money. It's what all the crime folks be using to pay each other with their nefarious dealings or whatever. Oh, I needed to look see about my daily challenges. 
Oh, I done did one. Blackberries, hideouts, free room events. That's why they call it blood money, because it's, uh, you know, illegal currency. So it's got blood on it, so to speak. Metaphorically speaking. Boy, Saint Denis is a good looking uh, little city, isn't it? Little town. What the hell's all up your butt? Hello. Alright, Susan, you don't go nowhere, okay? Hello. We're about to have to go get her some more hay. Steal the capital A stash, yep. Where is it? Oh, it's downstairs. Uh, he said downstairs. Now that I'm like, where is it? I realize he said downstairs. Back here. Oh, come on, bro. I was being dumb. Oh, I ranked up. Susan, where are you at, girl? Come on. Come on, Susan. You act like this is our first shootout. We done been through some things together.
All right. We made it out of here. Now, I bet with these Capitale missions, if I waited till the last minute to go turn this thing in, it would probably, probably be more money, more ducats. Now, why does the law is because they're corrupt, you know, like they're in on it. There's pigs. There's silver fox. Heard a goose or something. We're almost there. We're taking our, our sweet time getting there because we've established that uh, there ain't no reason to hurry. Evergreen huckleberries, huh? Milkweed. Why you reckon they call it milkweed? Look like milk inside of it. Boy, there's a bunch of gators over here. Come on, Susan. Oh, I can't get over that. All right, let's go around it. You better watch out. There's a gator over there. What was that thing? Raccoon? I was just about to say I remember it's kind of funny because like I remember back in the day there being uh yeah some sort of treasure over here give me that I bet this game will let me unalive a chicken. Dang sure will. I can pluck it and eat it too, I reckon. 
looking at you, uh, Assassin's Creed. Oh, I can't pluck it and eat it. Oh, it's probably because I'm carrying the Capitale. Why is it? Bro, it's literally right up here. Like, I'm not getting on the road and going that way. That is stupid. Let's see if I can find like a flower or something to pick in the meantime. Yeah, here we go. Here's some stuff. We want to wait for it to get under three minutes, I think. Some bull rush. I know some of this stuff, uh, like you use for cooking, and I think, I mean, I know I need to learn recipes from, I think I learned the recipes from the, the Thieves Landing folks, maybe? Why can't I equip my fishing rod? Because I have the Capitale? Huh. I wonder if I can fish from the dock over here. Certainly so, right? Well, we just gonna wait. You can't use a fishing pole while you're carrying something. That makes a whole lot of sense. Even though I got it strung over my shoulder there. We can uh, probably go to a doctor and sell all the herbs and stuff that we got. Well, that's a big old fish right there. What y'all reckon that is? Welcome back. I get it? We might go to the doctor. Let's see how much we get. There's your Capitale, friend. That should have been a fairly decent one. 120 bucks heck yeah dude heck yeah that's what I'm talking about uh so we should go see about I think there's a a Go back down here. I'm trying, man. Trying. I need, like, I'm about to be broke again, though. You know? It's easy come, easy go. We're trying to be set up, though. Hey. 
It's like super annoying to me to have to wait, like wait it out for the last minute kind of thing. Turn in those missions. Excuse you, sir. I don't, I don't much care for that, you know. But is what it is. It is what it is. Um, I'm gonna go stop by to see the doctor real quick. That was a huge chunk of XP as well, which is good. I'm having to resist, like everything inside of me is telling me to go up in that clothing shop. This guy's coming up on me real quick. Okay. Go up in that clothing shop and, uh, have have a little look, do a little perusing, you know. Yeah, it makes zero sense, dude. What? Tonics and elixirs, they're on the shelves on the back wall there. Ah, you supplies the cell. Okay. Appreciate it. Done. Uh huh. I think I'm going to keep the sage to cook with. Yeah, it might be. Now here, it's been a while since I played the um, the story mode. That sounds right, though. All right, Susan. Uh, let's go see this fella once again. We got five hundred and forty-one bucks. It's good, but it ain't good enough. some lucrative opportunities might involve capital a too you will get can't do that right now you know i can't give you this work till you got enough capital eh? higher difficulty higher your reward I'm confused as to the difference of these, right? Come you on. get paid in cash and gold and remember check with okay. Cause that's got a star by it. Does that mean the I don't know what that means. The law is gonna come after me, maybe. I feel like that is not very clear. Okay. Uh I mean let's try it. Let's try this. Why not? Coming to an enrollment center with. And where do I get? Where do? What do I do with Capitale? I reckon I know what Martelli has planned for you, but you gotta find out the hard way. Do I not have? You want to see what Martelli's thinking? I'm that costs capitale to do it yeah i don't i don't know i don't know we're gonna try to so from what i hear no i've never modded it it'd be interesting though ain't that nice 
Now, now, I don't mean nothing by it. We play it right. That stash of Capitale his old gang been sitting on is ours. One of the boys he's used to running with is holding out up at Butcher's Creek. Take him to Jeb alive. Jeb will find out where that stash is before you can say hot poker. Then all we gotta do is collect. You know what to do. All right. I I sort of I I'll, I've modded some stuff in the past, but I, just, I sort of try and avoid modding stuff because it always gets like really janky, and then it takes it takes like so much time and energy to just mod something. You know what I'm saying? Where it's like, ugh. And I know there are some good mods and good modders out there that are like really simple to install and stuff like that. But a lot of times it's just more frustration than it's worth. Set fire to the house? Yeah. And well, there's a there's mod managers and stuff too. I don't know if you've ever experienced uh, mess with any of those. Boy, oh boy. Mod managers don't work half the time. I use the uh, the one from Nexus Mods, and it uh, it worked uh, it worked pretty all right. But I can definitely see what you're talking about, especially when you get like really complicated with like load orders and stuff. I'm about to die again. Is he knocked out or something? There's a witness. No witnesses. 
it's for the greater good. <laughs> yeah, Charles, uh, I mean, he done, uh, you know, something, something happened with him. He got lucky. Uh, the well water at his house is, uh, you know, has some something, something good in it or something. Oh, we gotta, we gotta go. Come on. Oh, come on now. Here I go, screwing around. Okay. We got it. I wanted to loot all those bodies, because it said loot them for more Capitale or whatever. These fellas all got like herbs and stuff in their pocket. I'm gonna knock that fella out twice now. <laughs> Fast, like quick on their feet. Yeah. Toast was talking about uh, how it feels so much more uh, hefty, weighted, you know what I'm saying? Like W E I G H T. Uh, like, you know, ex as compared to like other games. So like Sea of Thieves, you're like real sort of floaty feeling. There's no like momentum behind you or like, you know what I'm saying? Like your center of gravity doesn't really matter. You're kind of just like jumping around all hibbly bibbly. But uh, with Red Dead, it's like you can feel like the, you feel more grounded. Like takes a while to turn. You don't just turn on a dime. You got to like sort of anticipate your movements and stuff. Which I like, man. I appreciate that. There's a skunk. We gonna get that skunk. Red Dead Online is floaty. Is it not the same sort of movement? Or the characters are faster? I could definitely see the characters being faster in online. See how far away? Oh, we're right here. That's some something I can pick. Oh, 
some jackrabbits or something down there? Boy, I tell you what we fixing to do. Catch us some fish, man. See if we can't see if we can't get a nibble out here. You know? Eat that fella where I can see him. You watch him, Susan. Alright, bro. I'll catch you later if not. Uh, I don't know, man. Just as long as I feel like it. A couple hours, probably. Yeah. Two, 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 maybe three more hours. Because I, I didn't realize how early it was, man. That's good. I can get stuff done in Red Dead, you know? I'd love to be able to get my horse. I was going to uh, switch outfits because I'm wearing the right fishing outfit, but, you know, this is fine. I ain't got no hat on either. We gonna uh, whenever we get to three minutes, we're gonna go turn this sucker in. A little nice little bluegill we got down here. Let me just put that in my pocket. Oh, that's a rock bass. Okay. We got a different species. We got ten more worms. That little guy, you know, keep that chain pickerel. Got seven more minutes, just about.
I forgot about that. You can flick the little bait. Get your uh, get a fish attracted to it that way. You got increased health. I don't know why fishing makes your health go up, but you know, neither here nor there. Well, that fella's out cold on the back of my horse. Can you cook? Can you cook these fish? I think you can. You can break them down or something. If I was, uh, if I was Rockstar, right, which, I, I, you know, yeah, okay, okay, you know, you know, I'm not, uh, things I would have done, I would have made different fishing poles, you know, because this is such a good little fishing mechanic, right? Like, I love it. I love the fishing mechanic. Really good. Fun. Breaks up the monotony of, you know, doing violent cowboy things. You're just out here peacefully fishing. Got a knocked out fella on the back of my horse. Uh, we gonna turn him in for something or other. And, uh, you know. Uh, but anyways, I'm just out here fishing. It's, it's fun. It breaks up the monotony. Uh, a little side quest. A little extra money kind of thing. Um... Yeah, I would love to see a, a different fishing pole. Like, that would have been really cool. And part of me thinks, you know, as long as GTA Five had been going on, been a thing, like, I wouldn't be surprised to see Rockstar, like, revive Red Dead Online. You know? That could definitely happen. All, dude, all it would take for this game to be just complete chef's kiss would be, uh... Some undead nightmare. Undead nightmare would be absolutely crazy. Make it multiplayer, where you could uh, do co-op or something. There's some herbs over there I could go pick. What y'all fish ain't like worms? About to say the fishing hole done dried up. We we're catching them just one right after the other. That's some good little fish, you know. Let's see how much money we get for this. We are almost out of worm baits.
We're gonna wait two more minutes and go turn that sucker in and see what we get. Uh, we're at 541 right now. We got eight gold. Uh huh. We got a tarot card. Or how much that's worth? It's gotta be worth something. We got five little chain pick rolls and you purchase. We got bluegill. Got some stank glands from that uh not an old uh skunk I reckon. Fresh Valerian. Twenty two sedative ammo. Interesting. Or sedative as some might say. I wonder what that does. I mean, obviously, you put something to sleep. Uh... A lot of times when I play stuff like this, and I'll turn on YouTube in the background and be watching a video uh, just while the game's going. I mean, you know, obviously I'm just sitting here waiting on a timer to run down right now. So there's different like schools of thought like some of them said some some people are saying wait till the last 30 seconds some of them are saying wait till under three minutes so i don't know what's real you know i don't know if anybody knows you know what i'm saying kind of a mystery you know Gang member delivered. Point four. Sixty-seven dollars. We can deal with a little sixty-seven dollars. Uh huh. So now we need to go see. And go down here to Van Horn. See if we got a. Uh, a what's it calls it? A who she calls it? Uh, a, a legendary bounty we can do. There ain't no, um, there's no butcher here for me to sell them fish to either. Now, do we try and do this again? The Eddie Doyle thing? Now it sucked though. Wait, all right, I'm going to Google it. Sometimes the smell coming off the water makes you think it's moist. Bye then.
Cecil? Someone's saying Cecil. Wait 12 minutes before turning in Etta. Let's try Cecil. Uh... Cecil. And I think we need to we need to make sure that we take a while to do it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if we need to take a while once we got him hogtied or what. But we'll mess around on the way back, you know? Just to make sure we take a good a good long minute before we turn him in. Killing people in their sleep, dude. Dude, Cecil sucks. We'd love to unalive him and turn him in that way. Underhand tactics. Okay. Nothing right now. It's kind of poetic. Way it's like all raining and we're out here looking, we're manhunting. You know, it sets the mood. It's kind of dang on all ominous. What am I looking for? Dispatch the enemies, you got it.
This thing got infinite bullets. We gotta capture him alive, right? Dang, they up in the fort now too. Do these guys just keep coming? Ran out and snuck me. He sucker punched me. Oh, come on, dude. I think I still, I don't know that this affects the payout. Oh, I got zero lives left. Come on, dude. Little punk. Come on, Susan. Let's see if did all these bodies over here despawn? Sweet. We can do we can do this certainly we can do this again uh without um 
without getting getting killed, you know? We gotta be able to. We might do that uh, next time. We take our sweet time getting there because we don't know exactly how long we've taken on this mission. And apparently the longer the better. All right. What jail is this? Where are we? Are we over near? Yeah, Ainsburg. Ainsburg. We can just uh, follow the train tracks in there. They want to protect that guy so much, you know? All right, what did he do that was so good? Old Cecil. Get some bird meat, you know? We'll cook that up later. We're going to the nearest jail, don't worry. I think I might just turn him in when we get there. I mean, I know... Shit up. I know, uh... We hadn't waited any kind of specific amount of time, but... About to see. How much money? What we got? Duckets? Come on now. Give me a bunch of ducats. I need all them doll hairs. We gonna get uh we gonna get a better horse.
Charles and Charles, look at that. It's old Charles and uh and old Charles. They're running into each other. They're talking about stuff, I reckon. 77. See that? Mm. I mean, it's okay. That's yeah, okay, money. Uh huh. Let me you go up in this post office and then I want to see what we got. 691. We're doing good. We're doing good, man. Uh, we're under the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. So I'm thinking that wasn't from like the timer really starts when we get him sort of in custody, if you will. You know what I'm saying? All right, uh, let's go. Uh, let's fast travel somewhere. We don't need to be here. Maybe to roads. Yeah, that's fine. 687, man, we're doing okay. We're doing okay money-wise, it's just not very fast, you know? Mm. Oh yeah, 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 that's why we came to Rhodes. Well, he sounds funny. Boy, you got a clean animal there. Five dollars for some pickerel. And get some bluegills. Sell some of them. Stay on that. Feathers for two dollars seventy cents. Dollar for that. Three dollars for some perch. Ninety five cent for the skunk. All right, seven oh seven. Uh, we're gonna go right here. I'm about to say, uh, excuse me. Give me some blood money missions. Part three of three. 
He's normally pay good. How about we go see old Jeb for one last time? I hope for your sake you ain't taking a liking to him. That's how you end up with a knife in your ribs. Play it nice with him. Give him whatever he needs. Kill whoever he wants you to kill. Cause chances are he's gonna want you to kill someone. But when you find that stash, trust and believe this. It's you or him. Only one way that capital is coming home with you. So be ready. Jib Phelps, uh, Capitale Stash, Ainsberg. Okay. Search the area. Oh, there's something right there. Blood. All of the blood trail can do. Boy, he running all over the place, wasn't he? Now jump this little rail here. He's up in here. Uh-huh. That the law? You suck, cat idiot. You know that? Now we got every lawman for 10 miles crawling up our asses. We gotta get out of here. Fort Brent. I'll explain all the way. I want that bastard dead. Go on. Oh, my goodness, dude. Just what did you one shot me or like dude I swear to god Jeb better not be uh He better be a hearty man You don't pawn here Jeb Can't shoot behind me with Jeb. Jeb, you gonna handle the behind shooting, okay? 27 minutes. So if we wait, okay, if we wait till the last three minutes to turn this thing in, I bet that's gonna be real good. Where is Fort Brenner and or whatever? Is that far away? Oh. Mm. Actually, let's go. Uh, we need to go. We could probably go all the way down here. I think that's for the fishing shop. If my 
my old friend Billy didn't let me down. The stash is up at the fort. He did get a little fuzzy after a while, but I reckon he done us right. Uh, only one snag. Some nasty old relics from the war got themselves pulled up there. Now, these boys are crazy, but that don't mean they can't shoot. We got to clean them out. Don't worry. <laughs> This'll be fun. One more thing. I'm gonna need you to take the lead on this one. One of them bastards back there landed a shot on me. That's why I was lying low back there. I'm, I'm fine. I'll be fine. Just a little short of breath. Let's just get this done. Just get this done. Okay, so there's something we gotta do over here at the fort. I hope I'm not ru like rushing this, jumping the gun here. But I was thinking, like, okay, we wait till the timer runs out. But now he's talking. We're talking about we got to do something here at this fort. Yo, Lemoyne Raiders and Fort Brandon. Hey, hey boy, stay to attention while I shoot you. Now, the real question is, do I wait for the timer now? I feel like we definitely loot everything before we go even near that circle thing. Uh oh. Dang, we are doing some cowboy things. It's kind of wild. We were bounty hunting for a minute, and now we're... Uh he said, I ain't dying today. <laughs> That's funny. Dude, I'm worried. I'm worried about this one. Not like worried, but like I don't want to let the timer run out, you know? Uh-uh. Better get back in a fort.
So much carnage over here, dude. Oh, here's more law. I wonder if they just infinitely come. Where's the stash at? Come on, Susan. I think we're heading towards uh, Saint Denis right now, which is good. I need to cook some food. All right, let's look and see where the associate is. Yo, what's up, dude? Prussia. This should be a good payout. Yo, what's up, man?
Uh, so I figured out on these missions, like if you wait till the end to get, go turn them in, then you always get more money and stuff. So we're kind of doing that. And we're trying to, you know, uh, make it fun. Well, oh, come on now. At least, like, do something semi-productive while we, uh, wait on the, the timer to run out, you know? Would we wait till three minutes or something? Seems to be pretty good. Some sage here. So we're picking flowers and all sorts of fun stuff while we uh while we wait on the time to go down. What about Prussia? Ain't in a place? Pretty sure it's a place. I ain't never been there. Ooh. Oh, I should've ate those. Eat a little bit of milkweed. We need to cook. I know we got some venison or something in my pockets. Uh, yeah, but we need to we need to cook some. Oh, this is the stash spot, huh? We got us a badger. Why can't I, uh... I'm scared to like drop and put down this stash a whole bunch because I don't want it to like disappear or something, you know? <laughs> if we can find more bushes to pick or something, that'd be good. Got me a turkey. Uh, we gotta wait just a little bit longer, man. Patience is a virtue. That this game is teaching me and uh, teaching me uh, teaching me lots of patience right now. I'm an impatient person. I really am, dude. Are y'all patient? Y'all good at waiting? I don't. I don't wait well. Like I am uh, antsy. You know what I'm saying? I got to be doing something. Like even I'll, I'll give you like how how stimulated how occupied I gotta be. Like when I treadmill, I can't just get on there and listen to music. 
I, I literally, I'm editing shorts or watching videos. Uh, sometimes I'll talk on the phone, but uh, I'll be on my phone looking at stuff while I'm talking on the phone sometimes. I try to pay attention though, but I'll get sidetracked if I do that. Uh, like I won't be able to pay attention to the phone conversation. But uh, yeah, even when I'm like exercising, um, I'm, I'm doing something. I edit, I'll, I try and, it's like a little uh, mini game for my day. Like I try and edit two shorts while I'm on the treadmill. Uh, and that's quick. I like to get them at least like nearly done. You know what I'm saying? Whereas like, um, I can just upload them later or whatever. Give them a good once over one more time and then put some finishing touches on them. But, uh, but yeah, man, not, not patient. I gotta be always something going, always stimulated. Otherwise I go crazy. Oof. You ever forget your phone when you go do number two, you know? Like, that's a terrible feeling. What is that over there? Great blue heron. That's a glorious critter, I tell you. This better be the last part. Of, I mean, it, this has to be the last part of the mission. Like, turn into Capitale. That's always the last part of the mission. And there's something with these Capitale missions where it's like you can spend Capitale to get to go on another mission or something. Like, I don't know. I hadn't quite figured it out. But uh, these are the double squirrel. Uh, these are the double there's double double gold double uh xp maybe double, they're 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 on like the playlist right now so like it behooves you to do these missions they're like the most profitable yo can yeah Prussia. is that bugged out or is he repeating himself Ooh, we got some ginseng. That's nice. Some hummingbird sage. I think a lot of these, some of these things are used to make moonshine, you know? I'm gonna eat this wild carrot. Your boy ain't had needs needs nourishment. Out here, look at how scrawny old Charles is. Mm. Eat me some evergreen huckleberries. Indian tobacco. I don't think I want to eat that. You know what I'm saying? Finish long nose gar. Non-player enemies lassoed from horseback. Uh huh. Perfect pelts sold. Get drunk. We can do that. Oh, I didn't mean to eat that. These wild carrots. 
I'm getting to where I can recognize the wildlife, uh, the plants, just by the little flowers and stuff, you know? Isn't that neat? I'm gonna get some oregano or oregano as they say around these parts I heard them say uh, them British fellas be like oregano you know I wonder if there's anyone that played this game like fully leveled up all the way by just out here picking up uh, flowers and stuff Cause you get the you get the little levels for uh, the little milestones or whatever. Someone out here fully just playing uh, chill herbalist. I need to pick up the bow and arrow. That's something I've been neglecting to do. This should be a good payout. I hope. I hope. I hope I'm not just being stupid here. I ain't getting on my horse till three minutes. Because that's what the internet leads me to believe is the best bet. So he's gonna be eating better than old Charles, I think. He uh Why is it still saying dirty? He gets good food. I mean she eats mostly hay, but we give her treats every now and then. All right, let's see. Let's see what kind of ducats we got. What kind of money did we make? 44. Okay. 132. Nice. We're close. 40. Boy, if we get uh if we get a dang treasure map. Coral ring, collectible ring. I swear I had a dang tarot card somewhere. I sell it? I know I picked up a tarot card. Hmm. All right, uh, onward. Boy, it just got like super dark. What just happened? Um, what was I going to say? That's weird. I know for a fact that I had a tarot card, but I don't know what, what happened to it. So that's odd. 
if I look in here, it should be right in there. Well, I don't know. I don't know where exactly it would be. It. No. No. I don't know. That's very odd. I wonder if it's because is it because I'm riding a horse? No, that can't be it. I don't know. What was that? We got a lasso of five NPC enemies off a of horseback. Let's go sell our stuff. And then we'll look at the uh, bounty board again. do that I think I'm gonna replace the turkey Susan stop it stop it just let me just let me put it on there come on now If I yeet it and then go back over there to it and try and stick it on there, is it going to work? Susan. Will the turkey go back on there? No. Boy, ain't that about something. It makes no sense. If I get on and then get off. Boy, that's dumb, real dumb. I don't even want it. Mm, I don't. Even, I don't even care now. Why is that a? Mm. Well, found a bug. Is that a three star one? That's a big one, though, isn't it? We can find a little baby alligator that's three star. That'd be that'd be kind of cool. All right, let's go. Let's go. Keep getting distracted. ADD be ADD, and you know what I'm saying. I know I dang had that. I know I had a tarot card. That's so weird. Like it's gone from my inventory. Ain't no way I sold that thing. You wouldn't think, I don't think it'll like replace stuff in your inventory. Couple of moons since you've been through here, huh? Got 
some fresh stock in. Seems like every other fella tries to sell me one of these. Four fifty for some turkey feathers. Oh, round back. Hello there. Welcome to Horner and Co. I need um. Hunting and fishing. We need to get the worms. We'll get more hay later. Look as long as you want. Thank you. Come on, Susan. We can go to the fence, too. I wonder, I wonder if it's just like there's an extra. Piece of. Like there's an extra, there's more inventory screen that I just can't see. That's like hidden inventory. You know what I'm saying? That's 53 XP per cook. That ain't half bad, yeah. That's more than killing a fella. Susan, what you doing back there stomping? Oh, stompy footy back there. We need a bolt action rifle. That's something we need. Because uh, that's going to be good for hunting. I think it'll kill an alligator with the bolt action. Oh, it, it, that's Susan. She that's she's a she. She's a sweet gal. Uh, we we love her. She's the goodest of girls. Not uh, we're working on getting a better horse though. We ain't gonna send Susan to the glue factory. Uh, but we sure might send um Gavin down there. Susan does know how to math pretty good. The rolling block? Yeah. Uh, that's one of them sniper rifles, isn't it? Like, I'm kind of broke. I'm trying to, uh, trying to grind out money, but I get frustrated, um, having to, like, wait for the timer to run out, you know? So I try to wait till like there's three minutes left and be doing other stuff like picking flowers and that sort of thing. So we're trying to, we're saving up. We want to buy another horse. Uh, I think I want to get the Fox Trotter. I always like the Fox Trotter. I think they got some new color variants since I played last. And welcome, Silver Wolf.
Yeah. I would have to figure out. I've got it on PlayStation. I would have to figure out how to stream on PlayStation, though. Like, that would be a whole. I'd have to get a, what, like a capture card, or I don't know exactly how all that works. I know it's just kind of, it's, it's way easier to just stream from the PC, you know? But I haven't played in forever on uh, Come in. PlayStation. What you can find hiding in the gutter. Remember, business stays the two much. No? Oh, interesting. I don't have a Twitch account, so that's that's something else. That'd be something else I'd have to do. I think it uh it links to your YouTube too, but I don't know if I could live stream directly from there. It'd be something I could look into. I severely neglect my PlayStation. Sell all this. Sure. See these all the time. We'll keep the carrots. We'll give those to Susan. Okay. Well, no harm in taking these. Mm -hmm. There. Mm. Uh huh. Yes. Yeah, that's what we were looking for. That trader award. We want to max that out. I can, I might have enough, might have been enough time to do another legendary bounty. These guys are squatted. Oh, squatted up. So, which is the best one of these to do? Say to add a Doyle, but then you gotta wait 12 minutes once you kidnap her or whatever. Let's, ah, I'm gonna be upset if I do on that. Ash and Tobin, Philip Carter. We did that one, I think. He's out there living in the swamp now. Let's try this again. We're going to look at the stream. Uh, uh, the swamp guy. I did that one earlier. It was tough. Those alligators suck. Etta Doyle. Used to be known as Madame Le What's the trick here, Silver Wolf? Do you know to maximize the profits? Don't I have to wait 12 minutes or something after I capture her? They play smart. 
Uh, looks like she only sent one. Okay, we gotta move fast here. Come on. Now the bait's already been set. Etta Doyle and her girls could be here any minute. Mr. Cornwall, if you don't want his name anywhere near this priest's, I'm sure you can understand. Just wants it dealt with quick and quiet. You're gonna want to ensconce yourself in here. Now wait till they bust in. Because I think I got like 20 bucks from turning her in last time. And escort her into custody. They want her alive. If you get paid, we get rid of her every day. Yeah. Now don't worry about her cronies. She's the one with the price. And I think I think it might be from when you when you capture them or whatever. You'll know for sure when you see her face. Got a big old scar down her right cheek. We're just gonna hang around and stand guard, create some semblance of security, and just pray the crazy bitch don't bust in and shoot us straight in the face. All right, now it's time. Find a place to hide, and we'll wait for the guest of honor. So she will come over here. That's what I figured out last time. We just gonna hide right here. Well, no, I like being up there where I could see. This is kind of boring. So there's different levels to the bounty. I might be dumb. I wonder if you choose the level. Do you choose the level, the difficulty level? Because there's like five star. You can, you can play a five star difficulty one. Twelve minutes. Oh, I reach a certain level. So it just like levels up automatically or something. Gotcha. Boy, he takes his sweet time picking her up. Shut up, Edda. Susan, where you at, girl? Oh, she's coming around this way. You think I won't be able to find you? You think I don't know who sent you? So, 25 is the time on the stream timer. Uh, so, about 35. Okay. 36, 37, 37, or something like that.
Only rob those who deserve it, huh? Well, that was, uh, I mean, that's, that's not super difficult. Like, we just ran up in there and grabbed her and then ran out. And now we just wait. Dang, so the maximum payout is 30 minutes if you spend 30 minutes on it. But I I don't have the desire to do that, I don't think. We can go see if we can get a critter or something. Buckskin Mustang. Yeah. You know I do things the hard way, Silver Wolf. <laughs> What's the best horse in the game now? Yeah, what's up, Glitch? Oh, dang, were you trying to talk? Because I, I haven't been seeing nothing. Tap ratio and riding styles. I always like the Fox Trotter. I'm pretty sure he's probably still good, or she's probably still good, you know, the Fox Trotter. And you got to get that, what, the no kadoches, no kadoches saddle, no kadoches, you know what I'm saying? You had to go on an alt? Weird, bro. Huh. They're very strange. Very strange. I know I didn't, like, put you in timeout or nothing. Brindle Thoroughbred is the best. I like, um, what's it, the Hungarian half breed? In case you get, in case you get put in YouTube uh, jail, get censored, you know. And I gotta be thirty-five, I think, to get that saddle. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, not your mom yet. Uh huh. Uh huh. Brindle thoroughbred. And you said, was it the buckskin Mustang? The Mustangs, I think, I think I don't like the Mustangs cause they look small. You know what I'm saying? I like a big horse. Like look at how big, uh, old Susan is, you know, that's a majestic creature. 
We're about to hit 25. We're getting there, bro. Look, I almost got I almost got a grand. And then we going we going to get the new horse. Susan's going to get a break. We're going to take her off the trail for a minute. My like dead eye senses ain't working. That's weird. I think these are uh yeah, I know, right? Susan Susan is a good girl. We like Susan. I think this rosette spoon bill sells for a lot. Oh no. Oh no, don't die, don't die, Etta. Woo! Alright. Oh no, I didn't mean to skin that thing. Dang. I just meant to pick it up. Oh, Etta. Where are you going, girl? He's making a break for it. I don't know, man. I don't. I hadn't. Uh, I hadn't quite decided. What you think I should name it? I like Jebediah. That's a good horse name. That'd be a throwback to an old Red Dead horse that I had. Call him old Jeb for short, you know? Yeah, I, I know, I know, I, I know. I know the animals ain't good cash, but I'm just in the meantime, you know? Mayonnaise? That's funny. Elmer. Thought those were pickable. Rip Kevin. Uh, we might keep Kevin, I think. I don't know if I bought another stable slot or just thinking about it. Uh, but I know uh, we're going to have at least, I mean, we're going to have three, maybe four stable slots. Ed. Ed's good. And that talking horse. Uh, I like Steven. Steven's a good name for a horse. Maybe just Carl. Carl's a good name. Carl, Carl is a really good horse name. Carl with a K. Arthur. After Arthur Morgan. <laughs> Stephanie. Jameson, Jameson is good. How about Jimothy? <laughs> Jim Stiffer? Bill Stiffer? Oh, uh, Billiam? Oh my goodness. Cream pie? Like the Boston cream pie? Coconut cream pie? Is that what you mean?
<laughs> I, I, I know glitched. I know what is meant. <laughs> I might have been born at night, but it wasn't last night, I tell you. All right, let's see what we get here. We should be like hundred and eighty, maybe hundred and sixty. I can't pronounce the Atocon. Uh, I can't be hollering that in the heat of battle. I don't think I... 134? Alright, let's go. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. Bounty Hunter XP. We got... Uh, be good there. Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, so close. Um, I'm gonna do see about this blood money again. A talk. Jimmy, <laughs> Jimmy would be pretty good. Arno, I'd name him uh, Edward before I did Arno because Edward is a uh, or Edwin. What you doing, fella? Maybe two coins. I can't give him no money. Can give. It's fine with me. Right. Dang, I thought you could give those guys money. Okay. You done some Cletus, that's funny. I did that before uh, uh, in Ark. I named something Toast. I named uh, Gigantopithecus or whatever. Them Bigfoot looking Sasquatch things. I don't understand these I mean I get I get the capital A thing, but I don't understand uh what's the stars? Like what does that mean? Does they are they worth more? Or does that just mean the law is gonna be after me? Another time for that one. Risky business these days getting from one place to another. We're gonna rob a stagecoach. That sounds fun. Got more to lose than others. I ain't talking no legitimate businessmen neither. I'm talking calm and cool. I'll be right back. The lamb. Running from old John Law on account of the dollars they stole. And running from Senor Martelli on account of the Capitale. Now I leave the law to handle their own affairs. As for the rest, that's where you catch up to them. Good
Let's go find some uh, some capitale. That's funny. Uh, Stephen Ward. <laughs> That's really funny. Have you heard him saying, uh, talking about my boy Jimmy or whatever? I thought that'd be funny to name it Jimmy. Horse named Beaver. Oh my goodness. Uh huh. I don't. I don't know what you what you're implying by that. <laughs> oh, I got the. I do not need my varmint rifle right now. Chalky starfish, goodness gracious. Some creative names you got there. I don't know that I'd want to eat a chocolate starfish. I feel like uh, just it being uh, starfish shaped would be unappetizing, you know? Yeah, that's a little bit more subtle than these nuts, I reckon. Oh, I'm on fire. Well, you want to throw hands? Oh, boy. Okay. See, I'm a master uh, strategist, tactician, tacticianer, you know what I'm saying? Cause I just waited at the top of that ladder for them to come running up. Smart. All right, Susan, come on, we gotta go. Uh, we gotta catch a stagecoach. Okay, he looks like he's heading to Rhodes. We can cut him off there. We should be able to just run straight to it and go off-roading. Ain't that right, Susan? <laughs> Good old Susan, that's right. She's a sweet girl. Sally, yeah. Susie. Here, okay, just take it. 
Yeah, get out of here. Oh, yeah, he had to call me a name, man. I'm just spared his life, and he's going to call me a dirty ass of a B, you know? Lady. Um. Uh, yeah. My name is Moose. You know? Lady from the story. What do uh what was Arno's girl? Uh Elise? Dog. <laughs> Rupert. Rupert's a good one. Or Bartholomew. I always like Bartholomew. It's a good name. I had a dinosaur, a monkey, a uh, Gigantopithecus, and uh, an ark that I named Sir Vincent Brimble. Great name. He was knighted. Sir Vincent Brimble. It's just a name I came up with. I name it uh Rocket, you know. <laughs> Timothy, you know. Timothy's a good one. We'll figure it out. It might just be Jebediah. Cause it's a throwback. That make me happy. Susan, chill. You're trying to climb up a dang tree. Name him, uh, I could name him Remington. Or Winchester. Winfried? What is that? There's gotta be some sort of fancy collectible flower or something, right? Vanilla. I almost feel like it's not super worth to wait on like this mission for the three minutes. I don't know. It probably, I mean, it probably would give us more, more stuff. Susan, chill. All right, whatever. You go on your way then. I'm gonna go turn in this mission. We waited a good minute, a good minute. Yeah, we stuck up that stagecoach, all right. There we go. There we go. All right, where are we at? We're over here by roads. Yeah. Where's that? Why is that not showing up on my map? There's stables right here in there.
Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, wow. Leonard. <laughs> Susan, just cross the dang river, please. Oh, there it is. I knew there was a stable over here somewhere. Uh-huh. I'm not going to name him Double Action Revolver. I might name it, you could, you could name him something like Nitro or uh, something like that. We're just gonna have to look. We're gonna have to look and then it'll either hit me or I'm gonna go with Jebediah. I am kind of leaning towards Jebediah though. Just for nostalgia's sake. Let's see. We're going to look at. We're saying we got an empty stall. We do have an empty stall. Uh, Kevin. Oof. I think I want to discard Kevin. I think I want to get rid of Kevin altogether. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Horses. Buy horses. We're saying, um, race thoroughbred. What was it? The, the buckskin. Nakotas. I don't like Nakotas. Must. Oh, Mustang. Wasn't it? Five hundred dollars. That is a pretty uh pretty okay horse. Look how small it is compared to the Turcoman and the Fox Trotter, though. The Turcoman is just big. I like the way they look. By the coolest looking one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Claude Ruber? I don't think I can get the Claude Ruber. Because I, I don't have any kind of trade or anything. That thing's slow? That's about as fast as the one I got now. Uh, was it, Is this the one that I can... No. 
There's one I can get. Is it Breton? Yeah. Those things sorry too, man. I ain't getting that. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, Missouri Fox Trotter. Dang, I need more gold for that. Or I need more money. I like that buckskin brindle one. Look at look at how beautiful that horse is. I like that one too, but I ain't spending forty five gold on it. That one, I, I ain't crazy about that. I think we're gonna do that, but we gotta go make more money now. The Turkoman. Yeah, the Turkoman is good too. Eed. It's like one slower than. I like the gray Turkoman. That's kind of pretty too, that chestnut. I don't know, decisions, decisions, you know? Mm-hmm. Very overpriced. All right, so this one has more health than the Fox Trotter, right? I mean, that one's looking, that looks, I like that. That one's kind of speaking to me. The Fox Rider got more stamina, though. We're just going to go do another mission or two. And then we're going to come back. Because uh, I don't have the goal for it right now, anyways. Or the money. I don't know. I don't know yet. I think Jeb was um, a gray fox trotter. I know. I know. Just to get the coolest one. I know. I know. You know how I am about these decisions, though. And I think that's why I am going to get that one with the white face and the sort of brindle coat whatever whatever they called it Wait, I need to be going to Emerald Station, don't I? Yeah. Okay. Do that. Dude scared me, man.
I don't know, man. I'm thinking about getting rid of Kevin. I'm never going to ride Kevin again, you know? So it's kind of like, hmm. He's just taking up a slot. I'm not going to buy another saddle to be able to, like, call him in as a backup horse. So. I don't know. I don't know. It's going to be sad if I get rid of Kevin. I know Kevin's going to the uh, going to the farm, you know, with all the other horses. How far away is this camp? Okay, we're there. They always be taking off running, man. He put the boosters on. They're fun. I mean, they're fun. They're neat little uh, time wasters, you know? Valentine be deadly, man. I seen someone, I wish I was streaming. Uh, I seen a dude spawn in. He was like 30 feet tall, like obviously hacking. But it was, it was really, it was kind of funny. I mean, it made me giggle, but it was like, what in the world is going on here? Okay. I was going to go back and loot, but where I am. Yeah, the story. I, I, I mean, you can read the. I like reading the little flavor text on the, uh, like on the bounties, like on the bounty board. Because it makes me giggle. Like this guy, I forget what he did. He assaulted someone. That's part of the reason I, I choose the bounty based on like what sounds more entertaining, like or what sounds like more of a punishable crime. You know what I'm saying? A more heinous crime. I normally go after the more heinous of them. Like we gonna go after the salt bounty over the rustling cows or whatever, you know?
ridden some bitch. Why he call me pox ridden? A little bit of oregano venison. That's right. Well, they shouldn't be bumping into Susan now. They should know better. That's what they should know. And if they don't know no better, then they're going to learn today, you know? I don't know if that guy's shooting at me. I ain't intending to find out. I don't trust these folks. Put them in the cell and let them sweat. Hope it was worth it. It was worth it, man. Ooh, when I hit 25, that's about to be a problem, too, because I got to buy... Uh, I got to buy the gum belt for my dual pistol, you know? And either buy another pistol or uh we gotta equip another pistol. Uh am I froze? Might be froze. We may oh there we go. No. We may need to try something. I don't want to I don't want to lose my my ducats though that I just got. I'm gonna give it just a sec see if it loads in. What the devil? That's all I can do. All right, we're going to we're going to do one of these numbers. And hope that I get my money. I probably ain't getting paid for that last bounty. That's okay. That's okay. Definitely did not get paid for that one. Awesome. They about to be up in here wiling, I bet. And dude's horse is dead. Look at, look at how, uh, how nice, nice I am. Look at how nice I am. Oh, goodness. 
Did we do another one of them blood money things? That seemed to be paying pretty good. I'd love to find a dang treasure map. Where's the dearest blood money thing? It's down here in Rhodes, isn't it? Bro, I can't stand. I know it's just a video game horse, but it makes me sad to see it sitting there suffering like that. Like, it literally makes me a little sad inside. Uh, We gotta be about where we can do another good bounty. I want to keep doing bounties for the XP as well as um, the money and all. But I feel like the the blood money things, they're paying better. But if we get... If we get uh, a level up, we're going to be able to get a treasure map. Be able to go get the treasure map. And then that's going to give us the gold that we need for the um, the horse or whatever. I just want I want a new horse. I like having the uh, I like having the fastest, you know, really quick horse. And be able to run for forever, you know, without it getting tired and all. Yeah, I do have Max Bond with Susan. Oh, that ain't even the right guy, is it? No, don't do it. Damn it all. Damnation. You had your fun. Let me loot. Yeah, that was fun. Bro, yeah. Old Charles just went in on him. Oh, there's a silver emblem ring. That's good. Holy 
All right, let's ride. I still am uh, kind of confused as to where that dang tarot card done went. Yeah, I've got a couple times wrote down already. Uh, I started working on one, just messing around. Uh, or already got it in my editing program or app, whatever you want to call it. Uh, just messing around. It was when uh, me and Toast first got in the game together. I've been I've been having a hard time with uh, just enjoying this too much and not focusing on. Oh, let me write down a time to remember to go back and make a short. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've been having just too much fun. But I think we're getting we're getting to where we'll be able to focus more on it. I've got two, two times wrote down from tonight. So... I'm just having... Just... I don't know, man. It's nostalgia, it's new, there's always something to grind for, like, I wish they just, I wish they would keep updating this game, man, and it's like something I love, dude, I love this game, dude. I was looking at my old stats on the social, uh, whatever it's called, and I think I had like a 175 day streak where I like logged in and did the, uh, these little daily things. Right here, these daily challenges. Oh, I can do that and get a Damnation. new Austin. Go to New Austin. Um, yeah, uh, I'm a busy something like 170 something days. So, yeah, we. I mean, we played. I like. I had a crew. I met some people. Uh. That I played with, we would get real sweaty on the PvP stuff, uh, the playlists and stuff. It was fun. You leave me the hell alone. This is back before uh, a lot of quality of life stuff happened. Like camps would always bug out. Um, there was no like safe mode. There was no parlay system. If you were getting griefed, you just have to leave the lobby. And sometimes we'd be the ones being aggressive. It was just, uh, it was more like the Wild West for real. Like it was wild back in the day. We fished a lot to make money. You know, we would hunt a lot. And this is before like you could do the profession to give stuff to crips or whatever. It was literally like just us out in the wilderness. Uh, you steal a wagon and stuff. <laughs> To throw throw the animals in the back, like it was wild, dude. It was fun. Son of a bitch. Get a wagon full of them big fish, you know. I'm gonna wait till three minutes, and then I'm gonna turn this one in. Yeah, nowadays it's really chill, and, and I appreciate like the advancements they made with like as far as. Being able to quit people from griefing you and stuff like that, but at the same time, uh, it it was always just wild, interesting. You made an enemy today. Shut up, old oh, Edgar. Stupid. Look at you, dumb. Imagine how bad that would hurt. Like this right here. I'll show you. Being on someone's uh, shoulder and then just to the ground. Ouch, bro. Give me that 53 cent agger. And he had, a, he had dynamite in his pocket. That's dope. 
I'm just elbowing. See how much Edgar brought me. The county thanks you for your service. I think Blackwater counts as New Austin, I think. 1650. All right. There's a daily to do a bounty in New Austin. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's a chill game, man. I love chill games. It's a. It's a long sort of grind. When like with the daily with these daily streaks, you get a seven day streak before it really starts paying out good. Like that's wild, dude. Most people don't have the uh, the patience for all that. Wait, this ain't New Austin? Is this New Austin? No. Let's go down there to Armadillo. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we going. We going to Armadillo. Uh huh. Well, those are just two of them. I mean. The two ones are kind of hard. Oh, yeah, there's one. Let's get that. Dude, these... And this isn't even, like, maximum graphics. Like, that's what blows my mind. Is we ain't even maxed out. Like, we've got it... We got some stuff on, like, Ultra. But I've got it where it runs really good. Uh, when I benchmarked it, I was getting around 100 frames per second. So, like, that's that's... That's good, you know. As far as as far as I know, GTA Six is gonna be absolutely nuts, dude. I need to put a. I'm gonna put a waypoint over here. She's riding. She's on the road. I think. This better be an expensive bounty. You think it should be. You're out here way in the desert. I got ride all the way over there. I'm talking about these graphics, so I think these graphics look better than PlayStation. Like I'm I'm not entirely certain. I'd have to see them side by side. But I, I think, I mean, unless it's just I'm remembering it different, you know what I'm saying? That's going to bug me if I don't clean my horse. I hope uh, GTA 6 is well optimized too, you know? That's a problem with some of these games. Like, the graphics might be great. I'm looking at arc when i say this the graphics might be great but they're poorly optimized so you can't really enjoy them on any kind of like higher up settings because it just tanks your fps and crash and stuff like that you know it's just like they try and do too much or they don't implement it in a way where it's uh able to be tweaked or whatever i don't know i don't know you know i don't know what's wrong with 
Ark Survival Ascended, but it sucks, dude. Uh, GTA 6 on PS5. I don't know, man. Uh, I might, I might play, I might play on PC. I don't know. I don't know. And I don't know what the online is going to be. Um, like I never really got into it on five, man. It's just, I don't know. It got real hectic, like real crazy. Yeah, it ain't gonna come out right away. When is it supposed to come out? Like, when is it dropping? Or they don't know yet. Twenty twenty five. I wonder if she's got a crew with her. I bet she does. Don't get any clever ideas now. Come on, Susan, get, get out, yeah, get it in gear, girl. Which one is it? Dude, that's so wild, PS5 Pro, dog. Oh my god. I'm gonna go check my mail while I'm over here. Oh, I can't. Dang it. Everything ought to run well on a PS5 Pro. Are you kidding me? <laughs> like, dude, that thing's gonna be a beast. How stupid are you, I'm always looking at new stuff, too. Like, yeah. I bet, it's, I bet you ain't gonna be able to get it when it comes out. Okay. Ain't no way you're gonna be able to get it. Because it's gonna be just like the, the OG one. It's gonna be so hard to get. Bro, I lucked out on mine. Like, I was checking, I don't know, four or five different websites, like, every day. Uh, to see if they restocked them. And then I finally got it, you know? Get the slim one. Oh, 
wonder where they're gonna retail at. All right. Uh, did we wait? Should we wait on this or just go ahead and turn it in? Let's just turn it in. I can't remember uh, what the four is like, what, 500 bucks or something? 499? Probably going to be like 800. 750. Got some awards. What, uh, where are we at here? Oh, I'm close to 25. Yes, five slam is four fifty. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, I got you. I got the one with the disc drive just so I could play uh, Blu-rays and stuff. You know. We gotta wait 12 minutes from when this starts to, uh, or when we capture her, we're gonna wait 12 minutes again. So I get that dang XP and, uh, all that. Physical, I love physical media, dude. I love being able to hold it in my hand. I've got a bit of a DVD collection. I mean, it's kind of a problem. I mean, it's not a problem. I haven't bought any DVDs in a while. But I love me that $5 uh, bin at Walmart. You know what I'm saying? I love good, bad movies, too, if that makes sense. Stack in the game boxes? Yeah, bro. I had to build a shelf uh, for all my movies. Because when Blockbuster closed down, uh, I was working there. So I got like my employee discount on top of like all the discounts. And they sent us a bunch of stock to like get rid of. So I had like, I put a bunch of stuff set aside and uh, racked up on some movies when Blockbuster went out of business. I got some really, some good stuff. She's the one with the price on her head. They're notorious for dressing alike. So you bide your time and you figure out which one's Doyle. You'll know for sure when you see her face. Got a big old scar down her right cheek. Is it, I think she's always the same one. Some semblance of security. And just pray the crazy bitch don't bust in and shoot us straight in the face. All right, now. It's time. Find a place to hide. And we'll wait for the guest of honor. Yep. Uh-huh. And go up here. How do How do I clean my guns? You know what I'm saying?
I'm gonna Google that. All right, bro. I'll catch you later. It's gonna be late again tomorrow. Back to work, man. Back to the grind. All right, bro. You have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Always a pleasure, man. happening over here man like heartland coral ring silver emblem emblem ring I'm about to get shot. Oh, shoot. Come on now. I need to wait 12 minutes now. Hopefully she's still tied up. Oh, no. Where's she at? Capture her before she's gone. Okay. Forty-two, so at forty-four. Don't try to act tough and ignore me. Can I not clean my guns in the middle of a mission? Go 
137 subs nice bro appreciate it man i'll catch you later dog i'm sorry it took me a minute to read that chat For whatever reason, it's not giving me... See me again. Much I want to clean my gun. Cause I got gun oil. Maybe it's a uh, during a mission. I can't. Oh. <laughs> While well, it's hovering over the gun of your choice, can't use gun oil. Red Dead Online. There we go. Dang. There's a glitch that uh, sometimes you can't use the gun oil. Apparently. I'll be right back. I think I'm safe here. Maybe. I thought for sure she was going to have escaped. I can't remember. I looked at the, the the timer on my stream, but I can't remember what, what time I had said that I was supposed to. Or what time I said I was supposed to turn this bounty in. We already aren't going to get full. We ain't going to get the full like payout because we screwed up and died. But, 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 uh, I think we, well, we should have enough to, I think this is going to be okay. Let's see, yeah, let's turn it in. Yeah, I'm always pleased to see them breathing. They'll pay their debt. The runner's ours, so the bounty's yours. Right there for you. Because we're going to run by the post office. And uh, I think we should we should have a treasure map, I think. There's Charles and Charles standing right there together, you know, just hanging out. He bumped into him and okay. How much was that? Noise. Alright, we need to go. Let's go sell stuff. Let's go post office. Then. Wait, hold on. I think we got enough. Yes. Uh, I think we got enough. Let's quit being dumb. Let's go back to the stables and let's see which horse we want. It's either a Fox Trotter or a Turco Man, you know? The Turco Man looks cool. The Fox Trotter looks cool. We're going to look at them both. Turco Man's a little bit bigger. 
horses. Uh, manage to own horses. Now that glitched is gone. Uh, um. Uh, Kevin, um, you've been a good boy. You uh, served me well. You, you know, ran around all hibbly bibbly with me for a while. But it's time for you to go to the uh, the farm, okay? You be good for him out there, and uh, this this ain't this ain't about you, you know. It's more about me, and ain't ain't nothing wrong with you, but uh, you know, it, I feel like it's best we uh, we just go our separate ways. By Kevin. <laughs> All right, now we got to we look here. We want a uh, multi horse. I like war horses though, because like this Hungarian half breed, like they ain't bad. That ain't the best though, Andalusian. They don't be getting scared. That's why I like them. They're like big. They don't get scared. Uh, Ardennes. What's that? What's the uh, the one I got is multi. I think the Turkoman's like part war horse. You know. Multi class. I like that one, the chestnut. Looks pretty cool. The Perlino ain't bad either. Gray one, I mean, it's just gray. Looks like old, like old Charles. Uh, But I think we really want... What was it? This one? Buckskin brindle. There's pink nose. Now that I look at the blue roan ain't bad either. I think I had that one back in the day. The dapple gray. Or I had the amber champagne. I know I had that one. Boy, that one looks really cool. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Uh, the Fox Trotter's faster, right? Fox Trotter's faster. Turco Man. Really doesn't, doesn't win it a whole lot. I like the gray Turkoman right here. I think I like the buckskin brindle, man. The gray's okay, though. Oof, that is so... So, so it hurts so much to be sitting here about to drop. Oof. All right. Uh, so I do Jebediah. He looks kind of, kind of like a like a Jerry. Let's do Jebediah. Good uh, sort of biblical name, you know. B E D I A H Jebediah. I could have uh, I could have just used the. Uh, Bro, why, why in the world does it put 
Why did it put him down here and not in the freaking first stall, man? Why can't I? Mm, and I can't. Mm-hmm. And I can't freaking. Mm, I can't uh reorganize these. Look at how much smaller he is. Old Jebediah. Small boy. Uh, I can't reorganize the stalls. You know what I'm saying? A little mohawk braid or a little mohawk. I think we just go regular on this guy. You do him what color though? A little white. That looks pretty clean, actually. 14. I like that too. That's almost like gray hair. I think I like that one the best on him. do that for Susan because uh and Jebediah since he's a he's a good boy we're gonna do that too uh-huh um yeah yeah make active Let's let's leave. Now we are sufficiently broke. Uh uh. Did we just glitch out? Where's going on? All right. Let's uh, let's go, let's go, let's go. We gotta go to the post office. We gotta go get that treasure. Uh, yeah.
All right. Where is that brandy wine? Oh, that is way TF up there, dude. Jeez Louise. We're gonna have to. We're gonna fast travel. Well, should I ride? Should I ride? I should ride because I got the new horse. We gotta. Uh, we gotta level it up. Where's the fence at? Okay, up here. Ooh, big money. Oh, before I forget. change that uh switch that setting up that way um just while i was thinking about it Look at Jebediah. Look at him go. He's fast like the wind, isn't he? That color is beautiful. What do they call it? Some buckskin brindle? I like his little white nose. Once we get the uh, the gold up, I think we'll do probably the supply thing with the wilderness outfitters or whatever. And then that way we can get, you know, the crypts doing supply runs and stuff like that. Um, and then what? A collector stuff? I don't know.
max out all the roles, you know what I'm saying? I feel like we should. I feel like we got to because we're online streaming online, you know. I don't know that there is a quicker way to level up your horse other than just riding it, you know, just being out here riding. Uh, I think I know folks used to just like rubber band their controller and leave them in the camp walking around leading. Uh, it ain't that serious to me. We just gonna, we just gonna ride, you know. But my boy here seems pretty quick. Can't wait to get the better saddle and stuff, you know? Get those real bonuses going. Way faster than Susan, it would seem. Already got more stamina and we ain't even bonded all the way. We'll probably get uh, one of those Turkum in at some point. We gotta almost be there to our, our destination. I remember messing around messing around up here like falling off the cliff and stuff oh this is about to be a doozy to find it's got to be over there on the other side Dang, I don't know that I've ever been back here on a horse. Yeah, yeah, I know, I get it. All right, Jib. Uh. Dang it, I dang it. come on now. That ain't what I'm trying to do. Oh, I'm again bonding for that. Let me give you a little brush. Then we're gonna send you on your way, okay, Jeb? Oh, I thought that was about to get me. Bro, there ain't no, ain't no freaking way, dude. 
Can I jump into the water? Nope. That settles that. All right, where are we at now? Uh, we up top. This is actually good. This is good for us. Cause now we can sort it. Sort of see where treasure might be. Bro, they. They got me messed up on this one, dude. Oh, there it is. Rode all the way up here. Oh, I thought I was going over. That dude escaped from jail only to end up here. Hundred seven gold or hundred and seven uh dollars. All right. Jebediah. Where are you, boy? Come here, Jeb. All right, uh, let's think about what we need to do now. We've done did all the story missions, I believe. I kind of want to go. I'm a collector. The nature of beasts. Camps all the way over there. Uh huh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we need to go here. Right here. I'm going to start saving up money again. For who knows what. We need wagons? We do need wagons. Uh, I know the hunting wagon ain't cheap. But I know once we get that going, that's going to be kind of kind of all right. The naturalist gives you uh, access to legendary hunts, I think, which seem pretty legit. Woo! Me and Jeb always almost went flying off the uh, cliff there. Almost got it. how you say it as the as the youngsters say it. Almost got yeeted off the cliff. You get bonding from like hitching your horse. You get bonding from brushing, from feeding. Uh, lots of different stuff. Oh boy, uh, let's see, we need 
accessories, right? We need that seven seventy five. That ain't bad for the dead boot. What is a uh... all the weapons here are regularly maintained? That's rank ten. So we ain't even close to that. So we'll get the dead boot, right? I think there's another one that we can choose from too. Horsemanship. That ain't bad. I get plenty of people coming in just for that. I think I like the dead boot a little bit better. Oh, hold on. I kept the town safe, but I definitely kept it out. I know so many high quality items, it's hard to leave. The Navy. 165 six gold we're saving our gold though people need their guns around here i do my best to make sure they have guns they can rely on All right, uh, we we got we got uh, we got our blickies. Uh huh. We got uh, we got double guns now. That's good. Uh. Yep. So that's cool. That's real cool. Um, I don't know, man. Uh, now it's just back to back to grinded more. Um, yeah, back to doing blood money and whatever else, bounties, bounty hunting and all that. Let's look at, um, before we end things, let's look at progress, roles, we're level three bounty hunter, uh-huh. So we got a long ways to go to get to where we want to be with the bounty hunter stuff. But we will get there. We will get there. Uh, and we're doing okay making, um, making gold nuggets and stuff, you know? So we're doing pretty all right. Uh, yeah. I feel like we're we're thriving out here. We got Jebediah. He's a good boy. Um, got our dual pistols. So that's good. Uh, we're moving on up in the world. We're really broke right now, but that's fine. We'll uh, we'll make money back another day. Uh, 
I hadn't decided if I'm going to be streaming this during the week or not. Uh, I do kind of want to stick with it. And I also need to play more Unity. Uh, so, yeah. Y'all know where to find me. Uh, I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.